Welcome to today's PowerPoint with Kurt Landry. Shalom. Welcome to this special edition of PowerPoints. We're talking about managing emotional intelligence. We're talking about self-control. We're talking about being able to spiritually override destructive habits and patterns and behaviors that are either common to us or, or come from iniquitous structures in our family line. And we're saying, how do we do that? These PowerPoints will lead you to be able to change that behavior so you don't suffer the consequences of bad choices. We're gonna to go to Psalm 103, verse five, and this really kind of nails it right on the head. It says here, who satisfies your mouth with good things so that your youth is renewed like the eagles. Our mouth is, and our tongues are the rudder of our destination. What we say is where we're going. What we proclaim with our mouth is what we have. So if we're proclaiming negative things, we're proclaiming anger and curses and frustration that comes from a wounded soul, then we will continually have the results and live as that wounded soul. But if we'll start proclaiming blessings in life over ourselves and others, then we start walking healed and we start walking blessed in our life. The Lord redeems us in our heart but out of our heart, the man speaks. So Father God, we pray. Thank you, Lord, for healing our hearts, healing our mind, will, and emotion, our soul. We say to our soul, receive redemption, receive healing, and we speak to our mouths. Our mouths will proclaim and decree and declare that we are the redeemed. And the scripture says, let the redeemed of the Lord say so, so I say, I am redeemed, you're redeemed. Let's walk in the redemptive blessings of God. 